This is Higher Homework 5 and we're looking at question 8. So functions f of x is equal to 1 all over x squared minus 4 and g of x is equal to x plus 1 uh, are defined on suitable domains. Find an expression for h of x where h of x is equal to f of g of x. Okay, so let's go and find out an expression for this here. Right, so for part A, let's go ahead and go for... We know that h of x is going to be equal to, just copying this down here, f of g of x. Right, so inside there I've got the g of x function. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to grab that there, see the x plus 1, and put it inside that bracket there. Okay, so here we go. So f of x plus 1. Okay. Then what I'm going to do is I'm going to use the f of x function, and I'm going to put in whatever's inside this bracket... I'm going to put into there where x is. Okay, so when the function's defined, we've got an x inside the bracket and an x goes there. So what I'm going to do is for this one here, the x plus 1 is going to go in there. So let's see what that looks like. So there's the 1 there, there's the line, there's the minus 4, and something that goes there is squared. So something squared, so it's the x plus 1. Okay. Right, uh, so from there I would expect that there's there's going to be the, the two marks. So I've got an expression here for it. So I'm going to go ahead and do part B. And I'm going to continue on from here. <clears throat> because I have to state a suitable domain for H. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to try and look at uh, some values that don't work for me. And uh, the way I'm going to do that is I'm going to multiply that bracket out. Uh, gather it together. And I'm going to factorise it and see if I can get some values that don't work out. And values that don't work out would leave 0 on the bottom line, and uh, anything divided by 0 is going to be undefined, or we're going to get a maths error in the calculator, as it usually appears. Okay, so, so let's go ahead, and what we'll do is we'll multiply this bracket out. So you could multiply it out by FOIL, if that's your normal way of doing it. So what I'll go for is x squared plus 2x plus 1 minus 4. So I'm just doing it in a, in a quick way. What you could have done would be x plus 1 times x plus 1. That's going to be equal to x squared outsides plus x plus x plus 1 and gathered together x squared plus 2x plus 1. Okay, so that's the way you could have done it if you normally do it that way. Uh, I'm just using a quick way of multiplying that out. On the bottom there, what I've got now is I've got x squared plus 2x, and when I gather these numbers together, I've got minus 3. Right, so I've got a, um, a trinomial on the bottom, um, quadratic in some way, so what I can do then is uh, I can try and factorise that and put it into two brackets. Okay, what I could see is x and x, because x times x gives me x squared when I use FOIL, and I've got a 3 here, so the two numbers that multiply together um, must make minus 3. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to just say that there's a 1 and 3 can get in there. If that sign's a negative, one of them's negative, one of them must be positive to make a negative number. And I can see this sign here is the positive, so the biggest number that multiplies out must be the positive. So that's the way I'm going to factorise it like that there. Okay, so from here I can see that x cannot equal 1, and x cannot equal minus 3, because if, if they do, I would have a 0 on the bottom, and 0 times anything will give me 0, so that, that won't allow it to work out. So if I have to state a suitable domain, what I could say is something like a, for an x, I would say that x cannot equal, uh, I'll go for the minus 3 first, x cannot equal the 1, and what we would say is that x is going to be a subset of uh, real numbers, just the r that's there. Okay then, so what I'm going to get here for the marks, I'm going to get uh, two marks for the expression. So I'm going to go for one mark for this one here, and I'll take one more mark for this here, to this level here. And what I'm really looking for is... For the suitable domain, that would be a, a reasonable answer, but I'm really interested in this part here, the, the numbers that really don't work. So, but really, that's what I'd be looking for.